in the hot seat again, huh? Without committees, we don't have a consensus to educate our children. There's just no consensus. We see what's happening correctly or incorrectly right now. We have a leaderless leader that is making decisions. So when you're talking about that, and, and, and here we go again, we're all going to be on 19 tonight. We're all going to be on five. So when you're talking about getting opinions, you will see how we responded to that. We have to have committees. We have to have parental input. Because without parental input, then you're asking me to give my authority away to someone else. We need committees. That, 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 that goes without saying, doesn't it? I saw your YouTube situation, Ms. Brown, and I was shocked. Because as a parent, I can't believe that when a parent gets involved in a situation in the Cleveland Public Schools, they are escorted out, removed. So that tells the rest of us that we're not supposed to come into that school system. That tells us exactly that we're not welcome. But as taxpayers, you do understand that the government nor the school system produces a widget for sale. The only money they operate with is the money that we give them. It's called taxes. Now, I don't understand where the, the, the Republican and Democrat thing come in. I think it comes into just human beings. Human beings being involved in their environment and in their society. <coughs> We must take a situation back under our control. We must take our children back under our control. I don't know what you guys remember. When I was at John Adams and a mama came up to school, we all knew she was up there. And we all knew that whatever you were doing, you had to get it right or stop it then. I could hear if my mama was up in the school as she walked in the door. It was like an echo. We need moms and dads in the school system. Okay, we need that. So yes, we will have committees and we will have parent participation in those committees when we're talking about a Jones-Gore administration. We're excited about bringing life and the citizens and taxpayers of Cleveland back into the school system. Thank you.